tonight on Will It Astro. Ads on boxer camera. Ads drink some space wine. Ads throws a box on the floor. Hello YouTube, I bought the um, probably the world's cheapest astronomy camera. I punched into the words into eBay. Astrophotography. And the cheapest thing that came up was this shitty little camera. Um, it's called a PC camera mini packing. See, look, PC camera mini packing. Hmm. Let's have a look. I've got some features. Can read those. There are your features, but hopefully that will focus. I'll drink some space wine while there. You read those. Space wine is great. So, red features with a sticker on it. Sorry. Can we take the sticker off? I the sticker will come off. Some of the sticker come off. There we go, I've ripped the box a little bit. But you can see the rest of the features. And me. Isn't that great? You can see me. I don't know where rubbish goes in space, so let's just throw space rubbish over there. I have more space wine. I think this camera was a £5.73 on eBay. It's got some instructions. What does it say? Instruction manual. Let's read it. Thank you for choosing our new generation smart webcam. It's a high performance web digital product guaranteed by our technology and quality. And it's plug and play product for real time data transmission to PV via USB port. Ooh, that's where the PV is. Um, it has high resolution, uh, 320 by 240, um, maybe not high resolution, and fast transmission rates. It is nice looking and easy to carry with you. Just bring it intimate and convenient life experience with your distant friends and family. There we go, kids. If you've got distance friends and family, you need one of these. What does it say? So, parameters and features. Ah, see you right there. Definition. 3.0 megapixels. I think that's a lie. Well, might actually be true. CMOS chip type, CMOS color imaging sensor, free, strong LEDs, yada, yada, yada. Right. Will this work with my computer? Right. IBM PC or compatible PC or laptop with USB port. I haven't got an, uh, I suppose Lenovo's kind of IBM. Hmm. A Pentium 200 or higher CPU. Uh, space computer, have you got a Pentium 200 or higher CPU? Higher, good. Uh, Windows 98 SE, ME or XP or 2000. Mm, doesn't mention Windows 10, might be in trouble here. A CD-ROM driving case computer is not equipped with software. 32 megabytes or higher memory, might run into an issue there, I only have 32 Gigabytes of memory and direct XVJ card. Yes, I think I have one of those. Right. Driver installation if you want to 
read how to do that, you can have a look at the fucking thing. There we go. Oh, I'm blocking a bit there, sorry. And there. Oh, oh, oh it's terrible. All right. Well, I think you install a driver. And um, that's your limited warranty. Basically, don't shit on it. Oh. Comes in a bag. Good sign. Oh. And a USB plus bag. And this is it. Look. It fits into your telescope's 1.25 inch eyepiece or whatever it is. And I uh, guess they've taken out the lens. Yeah, look, I think they've taken out any kind of lens or IR filter. So it's probably... Well, there might be an IR filter in there. Look. And it's got a thing on the bottom where you probably should have been able to mount it. And it's got a USB lead on the other end. I wonder what happens when I plug it into the computer. Will it install? No, because I can't find the old. I can't space computer. Install the space webcam. Well, I drink space wine. Let's see. Space windows. Hmm. Well, I plugged it in and it seems to have killed my internet. Which is weird. Hmm. And I was in the middle of space live streams. Plugging this into a computer fucks your computer. Hmm. Yeah, we got internet. Probably shouldn't plug this in again, kids. <laughs> 